we're going to be able to go on State Warriors and they're on the brink of elimination. But yet, people still think they can come back and make a series against the Lakers. I do, too. I'm not sold on Lakers, despite the refs being bought and everybody trying to push LeBron James and the agenda. Anthony Davis does look good in this series because there's nothing there to offset him, but you can't trust him. But I'm not buying it. It just... But let me talk about Golden State. Steph Curry, if anyone doubts his greatness, this series, he triple-double last night. He made some you know, had some bad turnovers, but still, overall, you can't ask him a lot of stuff. He's just not getting a running partner. Klay Thomas has been hardly there. Wiggins has been solid, but he hasn't stepped up. Jordan Poole is on the Ben Simmons milk carton. He MIA like a mo. Draymond Green looks like he got one foot towards clutch sports and the other foot towards he's just too streaky and you don't know where his agenda is. And Cam Looney did great in the first round against the bonus, but Anthony Davis is a different matter, but he's doing okay. But that's the problem. They just doing okay. You know, they don't have consistency. They don't have, you know, Steve Kirk can't, they can't flip the switch. And that's the problem that I see, you know, because uh, they look like a team that needs to revamp in a real way. I didn't expect they would repeat this year and nothing like that, but I thought, you know, with Steph looking like Steph, but they just look like they, they you know, they can fight, but he got to have somebody step up with him on a consistent basis. And, you know, you just look at it, and they just look pitiful as far as, and it's not like they're, you know, that far off. But in some ways, they probably should have lost to Sacramento in that series because they really don't look like, you know, in some instances. Now, I admit, like I said before, the bias is there for the refs and the, the foul call on that because they could, because you'd be realistic. Game one and last night's game, if the Lakers don't get all in free throws, could be a different story. But having said that, this series should be at least 2-2. And to be honest with you, the Lakers have improved drastically since they made their trades and moves, but they're not that much better. And Golden State has been hit and miss all year long. There's a reason why these teams were where they were as the season ended, 6-7 and seven respectively, because they didn't play that well most of the season. But this year is just what Golden State is doing on the whole is just not good. And it's an insult to to Steph Curry. They're not they're not shaping up what they're supposed to. So it's not a good look. And I expect some major walls with them. Just saying. He needs help. And he needs somebody to come step with him. I give Clay his due, but he really hasn't been consistent. Too many turnovers, too many bad shots, not aggressive. And they gotta make it simple. You know, and they can. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome thoughts, and comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. They're not necessarily done in this series, but I don't think they can win it, especially unless they can play some ball together. Please share if you want to. I'm out.